I've been warned about you in my dreams at night. There's something about you. Try to ignore the signs. Do you even hear me? Okay, now I can talk since I'm pretty much already done. But hey, Zoo, welcome back to my channel. I'm Zaria and I'm here with another video. Today is the first day of class. It's my freshman year of college and I don't really see too many people doing these type of videos when they get to college. It's like they stop filming their um, get ready with me on the first day. But I'm just here to let y'all know right now that we're going to do the get ready with me on the first day of school every year. Even my senior year of college, I'm still going to do the get ready with me. So yeah, but if you have gotten this far in the video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. I have an 8 a.m. class, so that's my f first and only class today. Um, I only have one class on Mondays and one class on Fridays, and it is the 8 a.m. class. At first, I was kind of upset when I seen that on my schedule because I was like, oh my god, I have 8 a.m. Everybody told us not to take 8 a.m. classes, and I was kind of upset. The reason why I have the 8 a.m. class is because I failed my TSI, the math portion of it. And y'all like, okay, so we were supposed to, we could take it. I think it said January was the, I don't know if it was the first time to take the TSI in January or what. But scores back then, to pass you had to make a 350 something or something like that. You had to make in like the 300 range. And I took my test in July. I took my test in July and after January it says something about the test scores going up to 950 to pass. Yeah, I had a 930 on my math score. A 930. Um, it's kind of stupid why they went up so high to pass after like at least go to like a 5 something. 
but they went all the way up to 900. Like, why are you being petty? It doesn't make any sense at all. But, um, yeah, I failed it. And I could have taken it again, but the only reason I didn't is because it was already late when I took the first test. It was already July. We started school in freaking August. So I'm just like, I'm just going to take this 8 a.m. class this year because I'm not going to retake the test. And then I was thinking of it like, what if I retake this test or whatever? And I pass. And then they say that the classes are filled up for the um, times that I want it. So I was just like, I'm not even going to waste my time and money. I'm going to just take this 8 a.m. class and call it a day. So, yeah, that's why we're here waking up at freaking 6 in the morning, 7 in the morning, getting ready for school because your girl failed the test. But it is what it is. I'm thinking of it in a positive way so far because I'm thinking of it like, okay, it ain't that bad, especially on Mondays and Fridays. It ain't that bad. It's one class, 8 to 9. You get up early, you get your day started early. And then you get out of school early, and then you have time to do all this other stuff. And if you don't know me, I don't wake up early in the morning. I don't. So this gives me time to be productive. Because it gives me time to do my homework throughout the day. It gives me time to go do things that I want to do after class is over. So I'm going to look at it in a positive way so far. Hopefully, my mindset don't change throughout the year, which I'm pretty sure it will, because I'm going to get tired of waking up this early. But, hey, it's the first year. Let's just try not to make any mistakes, any same mistakes next year or the following years. But, yeah. Anyways, y'all, y'all, my hair looks so cute. It came out so pretty. Um... I did my hair yesterday. I was going to do it Saturday, but I had messed it up a little bit. So I was just like, I'm going to just take this bad boy off and do it tomorrow, which is yesterday. But yeah, um, I'm trying to be up the house. I said, I was about to say I'm trying to be at the house by 7.30, but that's not going to happen with Clay because it's already 7.23. I know y'all probably like, why is she not in a dorm, da, da, da. I didn't move because... First of all, I knew that I wanted to stay in my hometown. And the college that I go to is literally six minutes away from my house. So it was so pointless to move into a dorm. And I didn't really want a roommate and all of that extra stuff. I didn't want to do the most. So, yeah. I just want to go to college, get a degree, and call it a day. I really don't care about the, all that extra stuff. Today I decided to get cute so I can take pictures for y'all and stuff like that. I think it's supposed to be raining today. So, I don't know. Hopefully it don't rain until after my classes. Hopefully I don't be late, but I think I am going to be late because I don't know where my class is at. I don't know where they at. Um, and it's already like 7.30. The class started at 8. Bro, I'm going to be late. I'm probably not going to talk to y'all much after this until after I get out of class because I am going to be trying to hurry up because I don't want to be all late. Like, that's so embarrassing. It's 726. Wash my hands. Okay, don't mind the floor or anything because the room was dirty. But this was the bag that I was going to wear with this outfit. But I don't know how I feel about it right now. And I don't have time to be thinking about it. But I don't know. I'm going to wear my black tote bag though. Um, so yeah. But this is the outfit. <laughs> Shoes. Dunks. Jeans are from Pretty Little Things. And the shirt is Lost Hope Apparel. <laughs> this is my boyfriend's brand y'all. So go shop.
Okay, y'all, so I just got here. Um, it is 7.55. I was pretty scared that I was um, not going to know where my class is, but I think I know where it is because it said, like, the Lucas Building, Lucas Engineering or something like that. I just seen Lucas Engineering on the building pulling into the parking lot or whatever, so I think that's where I'm supposed to go. I hope that's where I'm supposed to go. So, yeah, but I made it here on time. Um, just putting on my lip gloss and stuff like that. And y'all, when I was packing my bag, I put my oop, I put my MacBook and everything in my um in my tub, but I forgot a pencil and some paper. So yeah, we're without pencil and paper. Um, hopefully we're not gonna need it. If we do, though, I'ma just ask i hate asking oh my god college is gonna be so rough for me because i don't raise my hand bro i don't like asking nothing or anything like that do you raise your hand in college i don't think so i'm not gonna raise my hand in college unless somebody else raised their hand i'm gonna get out the car now so i'll talk to y'all later and yeah bye y'all i'll see y'all after my class is over wish me good luck okay so my first day is complete uh it was not that bad at all i'm pretty sure of course everybody's first day is never that bad but we just talked about like the syllabus and stuff like that what you gonna expect in the class and stuff like that it really wasn't bad at all and i didn't have no trouble finding my class i'm so thankful for that because I thought I was gonna have trouble finding my class, but I had no trouble at all. So it was a pretty good day. This was my only class. Let me make sure it was my only class so I don't be tripping. Yeah, it was my only class. So yeah, um, I'm done for today. It's 9.05 and I'm about to go take my pictures and meet my boyfriend in his dorm and just chill with him until his first class starts and then i'm just gonna go and run a few errands and stuff like that pick up some stuff that i may need for classes and stuff like that and also go to the grocery store because i need some pop tarts some more juice like i need i need some groceries okay y'all so i am now leaving the dorms um i was hanging out with my boyfriend or whatever until his first class started so now i am about to go get some something to eat because i haven't ate since this morning so yeah oh the lightning the lightning is bad but yeah i'm finna go get me something to eat and yeah i was gonna go to walmart and go pick up some school supplies but i feel like that's so unnecessary because if i'm not mistaken we have so many school supplies at the house so i'm not even gonna go and waste my time or money and i'm just gonna look at home and see if we got some stuff because i'm pretty sure we do because my mama has stacked up on a whole bunch of stuff so i'm pretty sure we have enough school supplies yeah that's what i'm gonna do oh that's what i'm gonna do and then my day is pretty much over okay y'all so i just ordered my food we're in the line right now i got my tripod for my car y'all and we tried to set it up yesterday but I got frustrated because my mama was worried about the fact that, um, you know, the cops may pull you over if it's in a way or if they feel like it's in a way of review and stuff like that, which is understandable, but I wasn't trying to hear none of that. I just wanted the, I just wanted the tripod set up, honestly. Uh, but if you are a YouTuber and you've been doing YouTube for a while or whatever, and you have a car tripod please please let me know how you how you got it set up to where like cops and stuff won't trip and y'all cops if you a cop and you watching this which i hope not but why y'all being so weird with everything like chill out trust me we're doing our job just like you're doing your job but y'all sometimes be doing too much okay so i'm about to eat my food I'm in the parking lot of HEB right now. Um, it actually took me a while to find the parking spot. Oh, wow. That was very disrespectful.
disrespect me. Get it, get it together. I can't beat this shit. Having some technical difficulties here. Okay. We good. Okay. Okay. Back to what I was saying. Um. Yeah. It was pretty hard to find a parking spot because it's not really packed. It don't seem like it's that packed, but maybe it is. Dang, I forgot to ask for American cheese instead of pepper jack. I don't want pepper jack cheese right now. It's okay, I guess. I want an American. I forgot to ask. But yeah, pretty much after I get done with the grocery store, I'm pretty much done um, with everything. I just go home, get settled, and yeah. I was really looking forward to eating this sandwich with American cheese. Anyways, y'all. I'm finna finish this up. I'm gonna talk to y'all. Huh. Okay, y'all. So, I just got done eating. I'm finna go inside. Um, I'm most likely not gonna film inside because it's just way too many people in here. Like, mm-mm. Mm -mm. I'm gonna show y'all what I got when I come out. So... That's how we gonna do that. Mm -hmm. Okay, y'all. So a little um, grocery store haul. Since I didn't film in the grocery store, I'm gonna give y'all a little haul. But I got I got some more cocoa pebbles, some um, pancake mix, some strawberry pop tarts, and s'mores pop tarts. I'm gonna get the boxes out of the way first. And some um fruit snacks. Okay, some um vanilla pudding. My little um the top part fell off. I mean fell out, so and then some chocolate vanilla pudding. I'm gonna do the rest of the cold stuff. Um I got some what is this coffee creamer? Um because I wanna start making coffee again um on like days that I, ha I don't have to get up too early because coffee um early in the morning for me just don't sit right with my stomach especially if I gotta sit in a long class and I'm eventually have to let that out <laughs> so yeah but I've been missing my coffee and that's the one I really like it's the sweet cream. I can do sweet cream or vanilla, but any other flavors, I don't really care for. Her. I like caramel, but it's not a favorite. And then, oh, and some grapes. Um, yeah, I just like grapes. And then I bought some ashwagandhas. Yeah, I bought me some pins. Oh, I got some coconut oil for my skin, really. I'm gonna goggle with it too. Like, you, you can use it for your teeth and stuff like that. But I bought it for my skin mainly because it's supposed to help with eczema and stuff. And I got a lot of, like, dark marks from the eczema, and I don't like that. So I'm going to try to go back to using it. And I got some more hand soap and some vanilla extract because I put this in my pancakes. But, yeah, that's pretty much it. That was the haul for, um... From H-E-B. Girl, okay. Um, I pretty much done everything. I um took a shower and stuff like that. Um, I was gonna pack my bag first, but I'm waiting on my mom to look in the room and see if we have some more supplies. So I'm not really gonna pack my bag right now. But I'm trying to figure out what to wear tomorrow because y'all I got so many clothes, but it's just like I need to get rid of like so many so much stuff. Like y'all see that back there? All them blue jeans. For what? Why do I got so many blue jeans? So I'm definitely gonna get rid of all of those. Not all of them, but most of them. And yeah, cause no. 
no and I got like I need some more regular shirts <sighs> and some shoes like your girl is she gonna forever spend money on clothes but I'll be forgetting the shoes what about the shoes I'm really figuring out what to wear tomorrow because it's gonna be raining and I don't want to dress lazy already on the second day like and I don't know if it's just me like when I feel cute like I feel motivated I'm, I feel real good so we can't have it raining and be lazy and unmotivated like no it's already raining it's the second day the first day thrill is gone so look cute at least that's what I'm saying so I'm trying I'm still trying to figure out what to wear because after I figure out what to wear I can finally like lay down and edit and stuff like that I, I still gotta watch that video that was assigned but I think I think I know I just got an idea I'm gonna wear this shirt with these black sweatpants and the Yeezy foam runners I was gonna wear the slides the Yeezy slides but they're too small and like it's not too small like I can fit it but it fits exact and I don't know if it's just me but shoes that fit exact it just looks so weird I think I'm gonna wear these with the um outfit just to give it like that that little Okay y'all, so that pretty much wraps up this video. Before I close it out though, I wanted to say if you are finishing up high school or considering college, I'm going to say go. Please go to college. Um, Although it was my first day, it was pretty good and I'm looking into the positive side. So just, just go try it at least if it's not for you because college isn't for everybody and that's okay if it's not for you then there's obviously something else for you out in this world so yeah but still try it at least you know um just a little tippy tip but yeah um that is pretty much it thank you for watching this video make sure to like comment and subscribe and I'll see y'all in my next video.